My new book, Just Living, Faith and Community in an Age of Consumerism, is about to launch. And as a way to celebrate that, I thought I would set us all a nice little Lent challenge, something that I hope we will all enjoy doing and that might bring a smile to other people as well. So the challenge is very simple and it is this. When you buy yourself a treat during Lent, buy the same thing for somebody else at the same time. So maybe you're at the station buying a cup of coffee. Why not buy a drink for the person standing behind you in the queue? Or it might be that you're going to buy some new clothes. Why not buy something for a friend as well? Maybe you're in the supermarket for your lunch break buying yourself some sandwiches. Buy some extra and give them to the person selling the big issue or who's on the street looking hungry. It might be that you're going to do something bigger. Maybe you're buying your, maybe you're booking your holiday this month. Well, how about doing something really generous and buying a holiday for someone you know who can't afford it? And this needn't stop with people. Perhaps when you're in the supermarket buying yourself a snack, you could also buy some wild bird food that you could put out in your garden when you get home. The possibilities are endless and those are just a few ideas that I thought of, but I'm sure you can think of some other things as well. And they all link in with the overall theme of the book, which is that living well in our consumer culture is sometimes about saying no to things that harm us and other people and this earth but it's also about living a life of generosity that brings blessing and happiness to others. So go on, I hope that you'll give it a go. I'd really like to know what sorts of things you do and I'd love to hear some of your stories of, about the people who were blessed by you doing this. Please give it a go and let me know. You can contact me on my website or on Facebook or on Twitter and let's see how many stories over this Lent time we can gather together.